All right. So, Fran, uh, as our uh, as one of our two resident um, therapists on uh, on the payroll, if you will, the, this Absolutely. nonprofit, if you will, mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. I came up with a tier list here that I kind of want you to kind of give your professional opinion about. I love um, giving my professional opinion. <laughs> I mean, it is what you get paid for, professional. Exactly. So um, we've got um, 10 characters from TV shows and movies, and I've got five categories in which we can rank them. So from the lowest to the highest, we've got mentally balanced, you know, just like, you know, you don't, you seem like a fairly reasonable human. You, you've got it together. Yeah, you're, you're mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Then we got, you should at the very least go to a support group. Like you've got some stuff that you need to talk out. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Now we got seek therapy where, you know, like you need that one-on-one, -on -one, like, you know, you need some help one-on-one. -on -one. We got inpatient treatment needed where it's like, you know what, you need like round the clock treatment. Like we, we can't, we can't do this on a weekly or bi-weekly basis. Right. Right. And, like you, you got to be in. I got you. Yeah. 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 And the very last one is just go straight to Arkham. Like you are oh, criminally so under insane. Right. Just All right. like, yeah, just lock you up throw away the key we dump dirt on the on the prison uh, sorry on the facility mm -hmm. just we, we're just washing our hands of the whole situation okay 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 all right so first up we've got Cruella Deville so you know the classic 101 Dalmatians villain she famously wanted to make a coat out of puppies where would you professionally line her you know uh, put her okay so Here's the thing. Okay. Right. Like it's it's the puppies, right? That kind of like takes it over the edge. Right. From seek therapy to we probably need some inpatient treatment. Cause you know, professionally, because you know, you pay me for my professional opinion. Mm -hmm. Uh when people are trying to kill animals, especially puppies, you know, we get a little concerned about that. So I got to I got to tear her all right off the bat at inpatient treatment needed. Okay. Right. Because maybe, okay. maybe we can get that back under control. We'd be like, hey, synthetic is cool. You don't need all the real fur. So you she needs some think. medication and stuff. And oh, you yeah. know, also, isn't that like high key a sign of like a social a serial killer? Yep. 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 So okay. let, let's let's get to let's have this intervention now before we have to take it to Arkham. Okay. I mean, she, she she's not, she's she's older in life. So it's like, you know, how, how much higher can she go? Yeah, obviously at least one more tier. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So next up we got Harry Potter and not not any Harry Potter. I okay. specifically chose Harry Potter from Deathly Hollows. Oh, okay. So okay. like so you know he he's going through some he's gone through my teacher tried to kill me he's gone mm -hmm. through several uh, a, a book tried to kill me. Yep. He's gone through wacky time travel adventures. Uh -huh. He's gone through why why are we having a whole competition where historically people have died? He's gone through, you know, I'm fighting, you know, basically, you know, um, the, well, I can't say, I'm not gonna, I can't say that word on YouTube, but you, you know, you know what, you know how I went down at the ministry of magic. Oh, okay. As well as seeing my mentor be murdered in front of me by another teacher. Yeah. 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 So yeah. he, you know, all that, all that, all that, where, 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 where are we, where are we, where are we putting Harry Potter? So, so Harry is firmly in seek therapy. Like he, <laughs> he has gone through way too much. <laughs> um, he needs to talk to somebody. He need to lay on somebody's couch. I'm, I'm thinking at least two to three times a week. It, it needs to be intensive, right? Dang. His copay is going to be out the ass. Well, yes. you know, he's, 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 he's in the UK. So they got that universal healthcare. That's true. That's true. That's true. So he got that. He, so just, need a, he, he just need a therapist that's going to be ready. Um, and trauma informed, uh, <laughs> probably needs a little bit of EMDR, maybe uh cognitive I, I, processing you know, theory. Yeah, EMDR. You, you can't, you can't just be throwing letters at me. <laughs> it is actually a treatment, sir. It is actually a treatment. Again, okay. my professional opinion. Okay. Plan. So why not inpatient treatment? Cause like the, the boy, the boy is not well. Oh, he's not well, but he's not necessarily a danger to himself or any, anybody else. He's got that magic though. Hey, we can't discriminate on somebody to some about you know him having magic. He hasn't tried to hurt nobody. It'd be one thing if you know it was like the fan cast of him 
like going complete completely psycho and saying, ha, ha, Dudley's. That, it's me and you. It's me and you. Matter of fact, sure, you just ate your child. Um, I mean, I'm sure that there is a fanfic of that somewhere. Probably. Yeah. Probably. It, the internet is a dark, dark world. So next up, we've got Sarah Connor, the mother of the savior of the world. Um, so first one, you know, you can kind of skate away with some of that stuff where like, yeah, a man claiming mm-hmm. to be from the future comes along and, you mm-hmm. know, sounds crazy at first, but then like there's a robot man after you and mm-hmm. you had a little sex with this man and now you, you, you birthed like somebody that's going to save the world. And between movie one and two, she's been committed. Yeah. But the thing is, she was right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I'm here's the thing, because she was right. Like, the world did her de- dirty because they thought that she was crazy. Mm-hmm. You know, robots are trying to kill her. I mean, I would think you was crazy too if you after you came up to me. But because <laughs> she was right, she's mentally balanced. She oh, wow. is mentally balanced. Wow. Okay. She was she's right? She was trying to war- warn everybody. Right? What's going on? Right? She's mm-hmm. trying to make sure her son is cool. And the world was just against her. She's mentally balanced. I don't know what to tell you. Support. Yeah. Uh, I think his name's Joe Goldberg, the, the main character from you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh, so uh, his atrocities, stalking and murder. <laughs> mostly, mostly that one. So he's the first one has to go straight to Arkham. Um, <laughs> <laughs> he has to go straight to Arkham. Uh, that man is for real, for real crazy. Like <laughs> he, so it's not that he just stalks you, right? right? If he stalks you, could potentially murder you, murder your friends, murder your man or girlfriend. We don't know. It don't matter. Um, and then be like, "What do you mean? This is all because I love you." <laughs> I did this what? for you. Yes. <laughs> he was like, oh, look at you. His the the scenarios that run through his brain, that is like A1 entertainment for him. Okay. Everybody okay. else, kind of a nightmare. He's a dangerous, he's a danger <laughs> to society. I feel you. Absolutely. All right. Next up, we got Katniss Everdeen, the girl on fire. Okay. So, you know, she went through um, you know, the Hunger Games, but two of them actually. And led a revolution. Yep, I was like, and a war, and a war. Okay. Uh, so, I'm I'm debating between we need to go to a support group okay. and see therapy, right? Because okay. uh, she's been through a lot. You know, she had to she had to like murder people, not murder. I won't say that. I won't give it that. that. I mean, that's what the competition was, though. Right, right. I'm just I won't give it that. She had to rightfully defend herself. <laughs> she had to stand Again, her ground exactly she she was standing her ground on multiple occasions and then was thrusted into a war that she had to be like the face of yeah. as well right so you know she's one who who really does need like at least a support group i think at least a support group <laughs> okay teetering into we gotta seek some therapy right all right. I mean, she technically she kind of has a support group with the you know the few survivors that are left, like uh, survivors of the Hunger Game, right? Well, I mean, I think by the end of it, P- Peta is probably like her biggest support, but that's also her yeah. man, right? So we gotta, I'm saying we gotta take it, take it out <laughs> of just Peta. All right, all right, John McClane from Die Hard. I mean, what's not to say? Like he he single handedly took down a terrorist threat inside of an office building. He single handedly took down a terrorist threat at an airport. He um him and Sam Jackson both took down terrorist threats in a city. I've mm-hmm. never seen the fourth or fifth one. Have you? <laughs> uh, I, maybe it basically same thing, different armor, uh, same plot, different armor. Uh, <laughs> I think it was um took down a terrorist threat or uh, in Russia. Okay. Uh, and then took down another terrorist threat. I can't remember where though. In that last one, not gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah. So here's the thing. Mm, here's the thing. <laughs> I got I got to put him in Arkham because whoa whoa that that. <laughs> 
hey, 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 hey. At some point, we have to look at what the common denominator is. All right? <sighs> yeah. All right? Yeah. This yeah. man has been away, been around way too many terriers to be the hero. <laughs> <laughs> the same with my, <laughs> we need to put him in Arkham for a little bit. Set him next to Joe. They might be buddy buddy. We never know. Okay. Uh, I just want to see if Google Google says he's killed seventy three people. That number <laughs> does not seem accurate. That number seems quite I, low. I I feel like more people definitely died uh, with some of like the later movies because those were like all in the public. Mm. You know oh I mean? yeah, flat or damn. Yeah. Uh, next up, we've got Ellen Ripley from um, the Alien movies. So the first one, she's the lone survivor of her crew, and she fought off an alien invasion. And mm-hmm. the second one, it opens, and she finds out like she's been like sleep for decades, and her daughter's dead. Um, and she had to go back to the planet and fight some more bugs, and she mm-hmm. gets like a surrogate daughter and a surrogate husband. Third one, they dead. Mm-hmm. at the end of the third one she died and the fourth one she's a clone I guess I should have said spoilers at the beginning of this but we good I'm just saying like she is one who definitely needs to at least seek therapy uh, she's gone through a lot a lot of grief you know we have to work through for her okay. right um, grief and uh, possibly a little shame because you know of having to kill um, basically a whole race uh, you know genocide yeah a little, yeah, gen- that, little, that spl- little splash weigh- of genocide. I mean, it can weigh on you. It can weigh on you. I wouldn't know. But. <laughs> All right. Um, I, I have a feeling I know where we're going here. This little sociopath, Kevin McAllister from Home Alone. Like, do we even need <laughs> to list? Do, do we even need to list his crimes <laughs> against humanity? First of all, Ke- first of all, Kevin is just a baby Joe. All right. That's Ke- fair. Actually, Kevin, let, let me let me put them together. Let me yeah, put them right saying. next to each other. That that is literally <laughs> same coin, <laughs> different side. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean the young man's criminally insane. Like the way his mind works, though. Like he's basically baby Jigsaw. I should have mm-hmm. put Jigsaw on this list, but he's oh. not on this list. <laughs> All right, uh, Daenerys Tar- Targaryen, Ooh. mother of dragons. I mean, mentally balanced. What? what I mean, whoa! Whoa! She, whoa! I, I'm. I, I, I just want to say I'm. Su- I was surprised by John McClane going straight to Oracle, and I am just <laughs> flabbergasted by Daenerys Targaryen, gen- woman of genocide, wait, being wait, mentally wait, balanced. Wait, wait. Here's what I'm gonna say. Here's what I'm saying. Anybody who can control some motherfucking dragon. We gonna say you mentally balanced, okay? <laughs> you ain't coming after me. I, I don't. I don't have any. I I have no notes, ma'am. Yeah, go go, go off, Queen. Go off. Yes. Oh, oh. Do we burn down the whole city? Ooh. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Play. <laughs> All right, and last one today. Scar from the Lion King. I mean, so Scar is the second born, right? Yes. Okay, so he technically didn't have anything like his whole thing is like he feels like he should rule and he's jealous of his nephew being born but i'm like that's kind of the cost of doing business you're the second born my dude but then like he took over and like there was like i'll say this he took over at a bad time like you can't control there being like a a a drought and stuff like that's outside of your reign but of course your administration is going to get blamed for it um absolutely absolutely on the flip side, we can say that was divine intervention, punishing him for killing his brother. That's fair. That's I'm fair. Just, I'm just saying. Now, Scar, Scar definitely needs to seek therapy because of that inferiority complex. But the fact that he killed his brother might need to bump him up to inpatient treatment. Oh, Is it oh okay. Is this a shame that both of the Disney characters are I mean, uh, impatient? I'm just saying. I didn't really think about it until like you just laid it out there. Um, that's that is interesting that that's where you rank them, but okay. also like, I mean, if we did Disney villains of today, I feel like they would be lower because like Disney villains of 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 yesteryear, they hit a little harder in my opinion. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Um, um, Frodo would definitely be in the Arkham. Yes. 
Frodo. Oh my God, that, that, that from, man. Ooh, yeah, that he, man from pure evil and using religion as a shield. Yes, absolutely. But yeah, Lady Mail Miss, I mean, appreciate you doing this with me. Welcome back. You know, it's, like I said, you know, we're getting you off maternity leave, you know, easing you back in. But yeah. Absolutely. You know, I'm yeah. the favorite baby mama, so we're good. That's an interesting statement to make. <laughs> but um, yeah, do the YouTube things, people like, subscribe, leave comments. Um, who are some characters you feel like I left out on this list? And maybe we'll do a part two with Fran or we'll get our other therapist on, on the line. Who knows?